ledge trapping. And it worked. And then the one time he went off, the one time he went off, he actually died for it. That's toxic. All right. Enough about that. Enough about that. Um, game, <laughs> game one against the Cold Valero. Cold? Um... I lost my train of thought for a second. Pretty solid Krom from Mid Hudson. He did he did win Eon yesterday over Walla, I believe, for the first time. Uh, super good stuff. This player, this player, pretty nasty. Uh, I've also been hearing about uh, you know from like other players talking about him, about how he's been getting better. Nice reaction on the upbeat, by the way. So yeah, this this player. On the come up, on the come up, Bolero. We, we saw, we just saw Bolero. We just saw him. He's super solid Zelda from the city. One of he's one of these Zeldas from Tri-State. It's him and like, it's him, ZTN, Ace Attorney, and uh, a few others. I just, I just, I just, I'm just terrible with names. Anyways, um, I can see this being like, kind of like bad for cold because I know he like he loves to kind of like interact with people so like playing playing against his owner like this is just kind of like bro let me interact but uh yeah he did take the first stop and uh I was just about to say yo what if Polero just knighted knighted the recovery knight just just outsword the sortie you ever think about how Zelda has like a bigger sword than like every sortie in the game? I think I don't think anything's bigger than like Phantom Phantom Five or Phantom Stage Five slash down till F Smash Cold. Starting to turn up the starting to turn up the what's it called the pressure right now. Whole stock advantage. Ooh, he went for it. Zelda was good before. People like super duper slept on this character. Like, even though the buffs, even though the buffs are still like pretty big, she was already really good regardless. She's just even better right now. Like, she gets more off of her like, like she gets more off her main neutral tool. That's absurd. That's absurdly good. And now she even has some new options with Knight, where it's like if you um, if you Knight and it's like stage five, and you forward air or back air. I think it. I know it. I know back air will work. If you back air, you will break that shield like it's nothing. Ooh, I don't know why he went to the, to the platform over there. I feel like you could have killed him. I don't know. He's a, again. That's. I feel like that has to be the same. Like that's also pretty big. Like that'll definitely kill. Like that up will definitely kill. Like right now. Like the more cold gets. Like the worst that mistake is. Oh, one time he went for it. That's mega unfortunate. Tilting the shield up, but still got hit from it. Okay. Video game. Blair refuses to die right now, but Cold also refuses to die right now. Jesus Christ. Never mind. Never mind. Did you know I have the worst? Commentator in the world. Even though Valero was like, he was starting to like figure out how to like get his damage in. Cold still just like he just didn't die, and that's that's kind of where Zelda struggles. Other than like the uh, you know the classic, oh I'm in disadvantage even though I have neutral B and stuff. Like. She can, she can struggle to kill. She has like you know her super duper quadruple strong aerial. That's one of the weaknesses. Anyways, game two, town and city, a lot of space, but those, those blast zones, those blast zones on the side, man. They help both of these characters, cause like you know, jab back air, phantom, Zelda aerials. Zelda generally likes to kill off the side. So does Krom. He doesn't really kill off the top that much. He's got his F tilt. He's got his F smash setups. 
He's got his down tilt. Tech chases. Like, both these players just kill off the side. So, like, this is a very, like, volatile stage. And, like, it's also volatile in the fact that, like, ooh, wow, he just approached. <gasps> it's also volatile in the fact that, like, you go from, like, three, three to two platforms to no platforms. So, like, that'll help. That'll help Bolero, depending on how like how well he uses it. But like, Cold kind of just not really a, uh, not really caring too too much about the FD transformations. And that right now it, it right now it's just Kalos. But like honestly, I feel like Bolero plays worse. Like, I feel like Bolero, Bolero plays worse on like FDS stage because like I feel like he's not using the. I feel like he's not using the platform list layout effectively. And he also loses his, like, main thing that he loves about Zelda, which is, like, teleport cancels. Because, like, if if you're to find the Bolero in, like, one tech, it's teleport cancels. So, like, not having that option is actually, like, really bad. Yeah, you can do it on, like, the ledges of FD, but, like, that is not as useful as doing it from those platforms right there. He ran up to him and actually pressed the B button. That was pretty nice. But like, I feel like, I feel like every time Bolero like wants to approach to mix it up with Zelda, like he just loses out. All right. Ooh. Wow. Tower spot, they're actually gonna take that <laughs> first stock. That was a pretty a pretty cheeky edge guard right there. Right now he's starting to starting to play a little more relaxed. Play a little more setback. I mean at this point, kind of have to. Oh, <laughs> 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 uh, oh we got dash dancing, we got ultimate movement. Cold's just content to just chill right there because eventually, hey, eventually, eventually he has to get up. All right, what? Chrome F smash. Cold's starting to um, <laughs> what's it called? Cold's starting to like get a pretty big lead right now. He's actually already overlapped him percent. That was pretty dirty. Oh, that was also dirty. That was late down tilt. I hope, I think. Into Phantom 5. Well, I'm starting to build up a little more momentum, but... Uh, that let, like, he gets, keeps on getting caught at ledge, but right now he's starting to... Starting to put on the hurt right now. Never mind. Go with the phantom. Get on life. That's really bad. Uh, Cole's gonna take it. 